Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm Chris HFM. This is another installment of the Rebuilding a Castle save with Burkhamsted FC. Now, as you can see, obviously, since you were last with me, which was Palace and Barwell, we then beat Dover, Chesham, Bombsgrove. We actually beat Hitchin 4-0, who's in the who's the main part of the episode today in the cup final. Chippenham 0-0. Sutton 3 0, St. Notes 2 0. We just played quite poorly, which I'm a little bit worried about against uh, Avil Church. I'm hoping that doesn't rub over into there. We've done a little bit of business. Uh, we've got in Simon Kowazic. He's Polish. We actually paid money for him. He actually cost us 50 grand. My scouts told me that he was much better than what he actually is, so he's probably not going to feature a lot, and I'll probably be shipping him out again soon. But we got in Josh McCracken, McCrackran, Josh McCrackran, McCracken, young English fella. We got him in. He's actually he's actually quite decent. Obviously, you can see he's three stars, three star ability. We got him in free transfer from Birmingham. He he's not a bad player. Obviously, we've lost we lost Callum Revel as well. He's gone. We didn't really see much of him. He's not going to ever set the world on fire. But today is all about the cup final. We're playing at Kenilworth Road in Luton. Burko, we are drawn as the home side, obviously. It's not. Tebble's just come back from injury, but he's he's sort of trying to get fit at the same time. So he will be playing in the final, and hopefully we can add some more silverware to our cabinet. Obviously, team for the final today is Potter in goal, Cissé Agungbo at fullback, Cleaver and Lynch centre-back, Hartman, McCracken, and Burnett are our midfield three. Tebble, Coker and Goss are our attacking front three. I mean, it would be really nice to get through this. I mean, the thing is as well, which is quite surprising, is that we are also in the semi-final of the build base trophy. So at the moment, we're looking we're like we could get a domestic treble this early on in the save second season in we could finish champions this year which could be the next game we play in this episode depending on results because we're 19 points clear with nine games to go um i think we got drawn i can't remember who we got drawn against now all i know is that there are national concord rangers i think that's who we got obviously they're in the national league south which is the division above us we've been beating teams bigger than that millwall comes to mind but if we can somehow manage to get through that, we could also win the build base trophy because we are the smallest team in it, like most of the cups. But they, uh, yeah, they're, it's only National League and National South teams left, apart from us. So I fancy my chances in that. All right, let's tell the boys, fire them up. They just look composed. Nobody really wanted to get involved we'll turn the replays back on because i always turn them off when i'm off screen that'll do right 10 minutes into the cup final then kenilworth road cse mccracken picks it up puts the ball over the top is cleared away burn it now brings it out puts it out to a gungbo puts it through coca puts it across and it's just over the bar from stuart tebble remember he's not exactly 100 percent fit he hasn't played for four or five weeks or four or five games. Sorry, I forget. It's not weeks in this league. It's, you play two, three times a week constantly. It's all about the fitness at this sort of level, which I've managed to keep hold of quite fit youngsters. And I mean, because they're 16 to 20, their fitness should be okay anyway. Cleaver long throwing in. Keeper come. Oh, he's dropped it, but it's dropped straight to them. And Hartman has a go. Has another grow and that's in. Alec Hartman with his 10th goal of the season. He's been out injured for the past few games as well. This is his first, he's played like a couple of 15 minutes, 10 minutes. He had half an hour, 45 minutes in a couple of games. This is his first start in a while. Hits that, it's a beautiful finish. And we're 1-0 up in this cup final, which is the cup that I wanted because I don't think we enter it if we get promoted. So I wanted to win one of the smaller cups. I think we're going to get two league titles. That's a poor bit of play from Tebble. He's got away with that. Hartman now. Burnett puts it out. Coca has a go and it's 2 0 us. 15th goal of the season for Matthew Coca. Jamie O'Hara's Hitchin Town's manager at the minute as well. Shout out to Jamie. Battle of the Tottenham fans this game. Coca then gets it and that's a lovely little finish across the goalkeeper towards the far post. And after 43 minutes. 
Bergkamp said they're in a quite comfortable lead and I think we should be able to carry this on and lift this trophy at the end. Keep it going, make sure we keep the levels up till full time. Kenilworth Road looks empty. Doesn't look like a lot of fans adventured. I mean, it's only up the M1, it's not that far. Luton's only about 20 minutes, half hour from Hemel, Burko, Hitchin. Might be closer for Hitchin. But I would have thought some of our fans would have travelled up. Stuart Tebble now obviously showing the effects of not playing any games for a while. He's going to make way and we're going to bring a Yomer on. The Yomer has been quite decent to be fair. Like just Look at that. It's packed. Look at that. Look at the fans up here behind the goal. This end's empty. The other end's packed. That's brilliant from Potter. Comes out and relieves the pressure off of our defenders. With 15 minutes to go. It's a great ball out wide. Yoma now. Puts it across and it could have been the icing on the cake. Ten minutes left. There's a highlight. Oh, let's quickly make a change. Oh, we haven't got any backup left backs at the moment because RF Watkins is injured. He's out for four to five weeks. Goss hasn't done a lot. We're going to bring Wendell James on. Just give him a little run out for a cup final. Why not? Look at that. Look, packed. Absolutely packed behind that goal. Goss puts it out to Ioma. Goss will go and score now, watch. Puts it across. Nobody jumps up for the header. Gilbert brings it away for Hitchin. Still Hitchin with the ball. It's a great ball over the top. Surely he's offside. Surely he's not offside. It's 2-1 with nine minutes to go. What do we do? Do we shut up shop? I mean, it's a ball over the top at the end of the day. It's not... It's poor defending from us. Yeah, we'll make that change. Five minutes to go. Ignore that because there's two minutes left. I think we do this. I think we bring them all back and go very defensive. I think this is the way forward. Hartman comes back into the heart of defence. Do we put Hartman? No, we'll change. We'll take McCracken off. McCracken for Will Tizard. And hopefully we can hold that for the next five minutes. If we let a goal in now, oh, it would be heartbreaking, wouldn't it? Look what's happened. Football manager's done it again, hasn't it? I've just made the sub to hold it together as well. Oh, it's going to go extra time. And I'm going to have to change it round. To get an extra sub, an extra time? Probably not. Nope. Oh, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to push these forward and we're going to play wing backs. Oh, it's not brilliant. We've never played it before, but why not bang it out in a cup final and hope for the best? Let's change some stuff up. Be more expressive. I mean, I could be, oh, why concede then? Why? I'm not going to be the happiest person in the world if we lose this. I've got to go for it with this formation now and just hope that it works. They've never played it. Go on, Ioma. Get a goal cushion. I mean, we're normally pretty good at penalties. Burn it, get there. That's it. Coco, go on. You can do it. I think I may have messed it up going very defensive at the end. I don't care if they're playing on familiar positions. They're footballers. They can adapt to it. Just get on with it. Well, it's so nerve-wracking, honestly. Big Cup final. This is the Cup I wanted. We smashed these 4-0 a couple of weeks ago. We let them back in too late and it's going to go penalties. It's going to go to penalties. Oh, mate. I didn't want this. I mean, look how bad our penalty takers are. The Gungbo. Coker. I've got to do it how it's, how it's put out. James. James. 
I mean, his composure. I'm going to go. I'm going to risk it. I'm going to risk it. Please work. Gilbert to take first penalty for Hitchin. Come on, Potter. Mm, it's right in front of our own fans. Well, it might be their fans in yellow. I don't know. Come on, Hartman. Yes, get in. Nearly a miss. It hits the post and goes in, but we'll take that. Max Ryan. Oh, he's at the post. Come on. Come on, a gungbo. Just slide it away. Give us a little bit of a cushion. Yes, get in. Come on. Come on, Potter. Oh, come on. Come on, boys. We've just got to score all our pens. Score all your pens and we win the cup. Come on. Coca. Oh, what? He's caught that. It was hit at 100 mile an hour. Are you sure, football manager? I mean, Potter should be saving that as well. It's embarrassing. Come on, James. Get in. Right, come on, boys. Save this one. Save this one, Potter. Come on, save this one. McDonald steps up and it's put in. And I'm starting to get that horrible feeling that it's not going to be our day. Come on, Bernie. I took a risk. Your composure's brilliant. Come on. Mate, you've got decent composure. Ah. Our first chance at silverware then. And it hasn't paid off. Hitchin Town walk up to get their winners medals. They scored in the ninetieth minute to equalise. The ninetieth minute. Honestly, of all the games to lose, that one. I'm far from pleased for that. We've played so well for so long. And you blow it in the cup final. And get £900, I suppose that's all right. I mean, we're looking pretty at £1.1 million in the bank now. Just flying up with a money way, but oh, losing to Hitchin. I mean, like I said, we've got Concord Rangers in this. I mean, we could win that, but how much is this going to damage us for the rest of the season now? Never mind. Anyway, we've got the next game coming up where we could be champions. So I'll see you after a short break. Welcome back. So in this game, we could possibly become champions, which would be nice after that abysmal cup performance that we put in on penalties. Team we're going to go with is exactly the same starting lineup as it was for the cup final. I haven't got a lot of fit players at the moment. We only played the cup final two days ago. We need to hit this straight away. Get back to winning ways. Not worry about the cup that's gone. And then maybe just worry about the build base trophy. Maybe we can try and get that one instead. The Southern League Cup was there for us to win. But teams do it. You blow cup finals. City got to the FA Cup final 2013, I think it was. And they lost 1-0 to Wigan. And Wigan got relegated that season. So it happens to the best of us. Now we've just got to hope that we can keep this form going. I mean, I think we'll still win the league, even if we struggle a little bit. I mean, Potter's played a really horrible ball down the wing there to nobody. And now he's in, and that's a goal. See, this is this is what I mean. This is what I'm saying. Sometimes you just lose one game, and then all your confidence goes straight down the pan. I don't want to see it again. I'm not in the mood because of that cup final, and now this. Honestly, I don't know what's going on at the minute. We're not, look at it, look. Not one player is grabbing hold of anything. We're not playing well. XG's 0 0.3, theirs is 0 0.2. It's 0 0.5 now. Slowly going up, but we need to, we need to knock this on the head. 
this poor run that we're doing. This will be the first game we've lost in, what, 60 games? So, uh, I just don't know. I just don't know. We've got to go out here. We've got to win. We've got to win. Look, the league is literally there for us. Imagine if you bottled that. I'd never, I'd never live that down. Never. 19 points clear and then you blow it after losing a cup final. Get hold of that. Get it in. Come on. No. I mean, look, we're all over the place. Cissé manages to win that back. Well, he's just running chasing a shadow a minute ago. Teb will now flicks it to Ghost. Ghost has got nobody there. I mean, look, no pressing. No pressing on the keeper. No nothing. Burn it now. Plays it through. Finish that. Get in. Come on, boys. 42nd goal of the season for James Goss. But we've really got to be, we've got to be firing more. We've got to be firing a lot more. We need to get this rut out of our system and back on it. Ideally straight away. It's what I needed. We'll demand more because I need the goals. We need the goals. We've got to win this league. There's no point going all of this time, not losing for 60 matches or whatever it is. Just for us to blow it. I mean, we're not going to blow the league, but I just, I'm just really down about that cup final. I wanted that cup. That's the only cup I wanted because if we get promoted, I can't re-enter it. And I really wanted that cup final. But it is what it is. Yeah, go for this one as well. And why not? Got to really, haven't you? Like, I mean, we could be champions at the end of this. I don't know what this. I haven't checked the list. Oh, I looked at the league, but I didn't look at the points. Get that in. Yes. Stuart Tebble puts us 2 1 up. Now, I think if Chippenham. I think it's Chippenham that are second. If Chippenham are losing, then I think we can win the league today. I mean, if we don't, you're probably gonna, I'm probably going to win it off camera because I won't know exactly when it's going to happen. And we'll come back for the last couple of games of the season. I mean, when we're still 19 points clear. So, and we got a game in hand. So if we win the game in hand, then surely we're going to be champions, right? I don't think we're champions yet. No, not yet. Still not quite there. But we've got that win straight after the cup final, which is exactly what we needed. Now, hopefully, we can press on with this and just finish the last little bit of the season. Maybe get the Build Bet trophy. But I really wanted that Southern one. Never mind. But I mean, look, we're 31 unbeaten in the league. I don't know what that 10 unbeaten is. Oh, oh we've got new youth players. I mean, Junior Door looks all right. We'll sign him. I'll just do this one and do the rest off camera. Long contract, 20 quid. Youth contract, take fiver. He will, bless him. All right, anyway. I'll end that episode there. I'll just have a quick look. I mean, we're possibly going to win the league in this bit here. I mean, I'll possibly come back for Concord Rangers semi-final. Maybe Kings Langley and Wellingard and City because they're quite close to us. But uh, as for that, if you like that, please give me a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Thanks very much for watching. Take care.